good day all welcome back to study nest in my last video i have shown you characteristics of living beings that in that i have explained you about cellular organization in this video we are going to understand nutrition so what happens when you miss your favorite snacks you go hungry all day Well, that happens to me. I'm sure that happens to you. Like when you skip your lunch, when you skip your breakfast, it happens. This is because we need food. Us living beings need food. We can't stay without food. I mean, like all the living beings on this earth take in food to survive indirectly or directly. Green plants use the process. photosynthesis to make their own food in the photosynthesis is the process where plants make their own food with the help of sunlight water and a few more stuff I mean like mainly it is sunlight and carbon dioxide and water of course they need it to drink and they need those minerals and stuff like that and what about non green plants and animals how do they eat well they all depend on the other things like animals uh, depend on plants see now let's say that lion lion indirectly depends on grass um, how well deer eats grass and lion eats deer so if deer does not eat grass eat grass there will be no deer if there is no deer I mean, if there is no plant, then deer won't be there. I mean, deer won't eat it, so it will eventually die. And of course, lion can't eat that dead stuff. You know, I mean, it can't eat it. I mean, for some reason, I don't know why exactly. So, I mean, lion indirectly depends on the plants because it eats deer. Now, deer. Now, there are a few types on like the different feeding habits of. animals which it is which we are going to discuss in our later in this video we have learned about nutrition which is one of the characteristics of living beings stay tuned for part 3